YouTube. So this video is gonna show you how to make a digital stethoscope, which is pretty cool actually. As you can see, these um, stethoscopes cost, you know, three, seven, 37, I can't even say the numbers, they're so high. Um, but anyway, I'm gonna show you how to make one. It should be virtually for free, depending on how big your junk drawer is. Um, I know mine was free because um, I basically had this laying around. Um, so let me just show you how this is made. Is you're going to be able to assemble this on your couch. I mean, I'm sitting here on my couch. I got my cat right here sleeping next to me. Um, this is gonna be real easy. So basically what you do is you take your stethoscope. I got this one from a thrift store, so I didn't mind snipping it. Um, obviously you can snip it wherever you want, and that's just gonna kinda determine the nature of your uh, homemade stethoscope. Um, another thing you're gonna need is a pair of headphones. So here I have just a normal pair of headphones and it has to be a pair of headphones that has a speaker on it, or I'm sorry, not a speaker, but a microphone. Um, and then you're going to need a piece of plastic. This is just to house basically the um, microphone. And then, um, so this is just a normal piece of plastic um, with a hole cut through it, uh, just kind of a piece of tubing. Another thing you could use if you, just to give you an idea, maybe um, something like a cavette. And the last piece you need is, at least for this sort of design, is gonna be one of these earplugs. And now let me show you the assembly. Basically, I've cut the hole so that this is gonna pop in there um, real simply. Um, and I don't need any more adjustments. It's basically gonna, you know, the rubber's gonna make contact so where that stays in um, fairly easily. And you're gonna take your microphone from your headphone, you're gonna put it into the back hole, and then you're gonna roll your earplug, and you're gonna shove it in there. Now I'm gonna show you guys how you can make a reading with this on the software um, on your computer. So basically, this is a digital stethoscope. That's pretty incredible, that was easy. Um, you can take your headphone also, and you can listen to the audio um, of your readings. Obviously, you're gonna take this tell end and you're gonna put it into your computer and your computer should recognize uh, the headphone um, microphone in your headphone um, set. And so let me show you both the software and a reading that I've made with this uh, exact stethoscope. All right guys, so here's the software. You can download this for free by the way and measure some of your heart sounds uh, relatively easily. So what I have here is an audio file that I recorded with the exact stethoscope that I showed you guys I was assembling in the previous section. And uh, let me just play it for you real quick um, on normal gain. So what you're noticing right away is that it's extremely quiet, which you know initially if you assemble your stethoscope, you're gonna be probably pretty upset about that because you wanna hear all those sounds in graphic detail um, and maybe yeah, I'm on full volume now. Um, so what you can do is you can gain some decibels here. I'm gonna only gain us a couple decibels. There's some Nino in the hall screaming and I've had to record this a couple times. So let's just ignore that uh, Nino. She must be having a hard day. Let me just play this file for you on a little bit of gain. And notice you can also even hear the, the uh, lung sounds. Which I, I, what I would say is pretty high acuity. So, um, one more time. And normally you, I'm not sure what's what's the deal with this uh, recording, but I can't pull up the long sounds. Normally you can push this um, little display button and it'll pop those up and show you the topology of those long sounds themselves. Obviously there's a lot of um, features you can sort of explore here and um, kind of have fun with heart sounds if that's kind of what you're doing. Uh, you can zoom in, uh, you can say I don't like one of these heart sounds, I can clip that one out just like that. Uh, so overall for a free piece of software with Audacity, Think Labs phono, uh, Phonocardiography powered by Audacity, you know, pretty cool. Let me show you real quick how you can get this easily. You got thinklabs.com the exact uh, address is this. Uh, so basically go to that website, 
come down here and find whatever your uh, operating system is real quick and easy um, in any case thanks guys for watching uh, please like the video if you liked it and try to appreciate if you do make it the stethoscope how cool that is that you can just take you know these basic sort of pieces and make an awesome digital stethoscope for I mean basically free cheers guys have a good day